Hi guys, in this tutorial I'll show you how to create a smooth car reveal effect in After Effects. Let's get started. Here I have two clips that I'm going to create a transition with. First scroll to the end of your first clip, then go back 40 frames, hold shift and press page up 4 times. Move the second clip to that point so it overlaps the first clip by 40 frames. Next go to the end of the first clip again and split the second clip on top. The left piece of this clip will be the transition part that we'll be working with. Now we need to isolate the car from the background. Scroll to the beginning of the left piece of the clip, select the roto brush tool, and double click on that layer. Start rotoscoping the car as smoothly as possible. When you're done, click the freeze button. Once freezing is complete, close the rotoscoping window. Now that we have the isolated car, we also need a background layer without the car. Duplicate the rotoscoped layer, then rename both layers to stay organized. Rename the top layer to car only, the bottom layer to background. Make sure the background layer is selected and you're at the beginning of it. Select the roto brush tool again and double click the background layer. Since we duplicated the rotoscoped layer, the selection is copied. All we need to do is invert it to isolate the background. First click the freeze button to unfreeze the selection. Then click invert foreground slash background, and click freeze button again to lock the rotoscoping. Once it's finished, close the rotoscoping window. Now if you check both layers, you'll have an isolated car layer and an isolated background layer. We can use these to create the car reveal transition. Select the car only layer and scroll to its end. Press P to open the position properties, then click the stopwatch icon. Next scroll back to the beginning of the car only layer and adjust the position. I'll move the Y position all the way up to create a slamming effect. Next select both position keyframes and press F9 to easy ease them. Then open the graph editor and create a smooth curve. Let's check the animation. Looks good to me. Now close the graph editor and enable motion blur on the car only layer. Then select the background layer, scroll to its end, and apply a luma key effect. Set the edge feather to about 10. Click the threshold stopwatch to add a keyframe and make sure the value is set to 0. Then scroll to the beginning of the background layer and increase the threshold to 255. Now we can preview the transition and see if we need to add anything else. Everything looks good, so I'll add a shake effect at the end of the transition using one from my shake pack. Then let's preview it again. You can grab the AM Film Shakes pack from the link in the description. I've also made plenty of shake tutorials, so feel free to check those out as well. Hope you found this video helpful, thanks for watching and if you enjoyed it, please give it a like.